Thanks, Alex, and once again, congratulations to all of the award winners. Keep up the amazing work. Now, as you can see behind me, I'm here at the Cardiff City Stadium where Wales take on Croatia in another tough European qualifying campaign game. I've been talking to some of the fans. Uh, let's go find out what they think about the draw against Slovakia and how they think we get on tonight. Tough fixture tonight. How do you think you're going to get on? I thought they confident I'd take a draw at the moment, but who knows? They do a good performance again. I'm quite excited, I think, uh, after our performance in Slovakia, we should be expecting something out of this game today. I think it's going to be a tough one, but uh, looking back in the times where we've had to do it against teams like Belgium, I think we can do it again. Nice, solid, 1-0 win. This has got the feels of uh, Belgium. Belgium home when we won 1-0 and Gareth Bale scored. Yeah. It's got the feels of it. Can you feel that energy tonight? No, not yet, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Who's your favourite player? Uh, Daniel James. Daniel James. Why Daniel James? Um, because he's just a beast. He's a beast. He's a beast. Yeah, that is a beast. Dan, you're a beast. So what do you think the game's going to be tonight? How do you think it's going to go? 1-1. Um, 1-1. One, one. One, one. Nice. Who do you think it's going to score? Um, Bale for Wales and Modric for... Going with the big guns, yeah. yeah. What do you think the score's going to be? Um, like, about a draw, like 2-1. Two two yeah, two maybe all? a draw. Yeah. 100 nil. 100 nil. Damn, I'm optimistic. I love that. To be fair, I would happily take a point because uh, uh, with, with the with the group it is right now, anything can happen. So I think what we can take from let's, let's say a World Cup final, this team like you know Croatia, well, if we can take this on to Hungary and Azerbaijan, we can get points from there. So you know, I'm not particularly too fast, but if we can get a win tonight, I'll be happy days. I said I said three 0 to Croatia, but I'm gonna go for Wales two one. He's changing now. He's on camera. <laughs> I'm on camera two one to Wales. Um, I think we can definitely beat Azerbaijan and Hungary, but tonight's gonna be the hardest game out of them all. I reckon. I think two all. I think we're gonna score a late equaliser, and but I still think they'll dominate the game. Okay. Yeah. But you'd be happy with the draw then? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I hope uh, we will make an, uh, a draw. A draw? Yeah, that's You'll be happy good. with a draw? Yeah, we will be happy with a draw. Okay. I'll be happy what with do you a think? win. I'll be happy with a win. Yeah, and then we will uh, fix uh, the other things for you. Oh, well, so you not, can yeah. come with us to the European Championship. I team. would love to make you to come with us yeah. on this adventure of the European Championship. I love Because you. we love Wales. Good result tonight. Yeah, decent against a team like yeah, Croatia. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good draw, I reckon. Who is your standout player? Uh, what's his name? Johnny Williams. Johnny Williams. Johnny Williams yeah. In the end, it's, it's not a bad result. I think um, a couple of years ago, then the World Cup final, um, the team that's been together for a very long time, and you can see that at times they're a very good team. But I thought um, could have nicked it today, which is the coming off the pitch against Croatia, thinking we could have got more than a draw. It shows how far we've come in our recent, you know, camps. And um, yeah, it's great to be back playing in the Welsh shirt. I thought we uh, deserved to win that. To be fair, without Ram Ramsey, we've done well. Well, the three enjoyed it, to be honest. We were so... We didn't know what to expect to be before the game, but the boys, they put these stuck in, didn't they? I thought it was a decent performance tonight. It's good for our confidence going into two massive games under the group now. 
regardless of the result today, that's probably the main games we were targeting. But today's a bonus that hopefully we don't, uh, you know, we won't come down to a head-to-head -head situation. It's a bit of a free for all this group. <laughs> it really is, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it is. I think it's one of the. It's probably the hardest group out of the lot. So, we've heard from Wales fans, we've heard from Croatia fans. Now, Alex, I really want to hear from you. What do you think about that game? If you'd have offered me a point in minute one, I'd have taken your hand off. But in the, well, what do we get up to, 98 minutes? Yeah. I was like, Chill, I, I wanted more from that game. I think we could have got more. Definitely. And right at the end, I think both teams were just happy with the point. You know, there were so many casualties as well. I mean, everyone was all over the shop. It was a war. Yeah. A war of attrition out there. And, you know, we would see who's come out of it with the least amount of knocks. And now, now we need a favour. Mm -hmm. Now we need those guys to go and knock over Slovakia. Come on, Croatia, do us a favour. And this, this entire programme, a week of FC Cymru, shows what the whole thing is all about. We've got community stuff, we've got Wales away. We've got grassroots, we've got Wales at home. Everything that everybody gives to football, and we love talking about it at any level in any part of the country. That is FC Cumberland.